As you head to Beavers men's hockey games this season, you might want to grab a roster. No more Mike Bitzer, no more Fitzgerald triplets, and a whole bunch of new faces that need to step up. It's a youthful team for the Beavers this year, as underclassmen make up the majority, and nine newcomers have added some excitement into the locker room. You know, you see that many freshmen coming in, and I think what it presents is, uh, like, opportunity. So, you know, whenever there's a challenge, we see it as opportunity, and we're looking forward to that. Maybe more than anything, the competition amongst the team, uh, I think, is going to be really good. So hopefully that can bring out the best in, in everyone. Coach Saratori has named two co-captains and three assistant captains, which he says is both unprecedented and by design. When you have a young group, you want to have a leadership group that maybe all these guys can identify with. They can identify with somebody in that room. I think it's important to have a bigger leadership group when you have a young group like this. The team's experience lies on the blue line as five upperclassmen who saw significant playing time return. If you see our, our defensive core, and I think that's the you know the base of our team, just with the senior, uh, seniority and uh, you know the amount of games played. There's versatility. We are, it's a good skating core. We've got some good defenders. We've got some guys who can generate some offense. The biggest question is who will be in net, as returners Jack Burgart and Henry Johnson and newcomer sophomore Zach Driscoll will all be vying for the job. You know Jack and Hank coming back. I think they've they both had good summers. They look great. And then uh, you know Driscoll coming in. He's looked great as well, so your guess is about as good as mine right now who's going to play. They, uh, I think they're all bringing out the best in each other, though. We're not sitting there making a lot of decisions right now because practice is very difficult. To a certain degree, they need to get in. They need to get in games. You know, someone's going to step up, and they're all going to step up in different times, and, you know, it's going to be interesting to see how it plays out. And Saratori says the goalies will each get a period as the team begins its season on Saturday for an exhibition contest. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.